quiet and subdued, Alex Tickleman entered a plea of not guilty. Bond remained at $1.5 million. Her tattooed wrists in handcuffs, she went back into custody. A very different woman. It's going to take a little bit on a fluffy brush. Then the Alex Tickleman on YouTube cheerfully giving makeup color. tips or the one on Twitter flaunting her body in numerous provocative images. The heavily mascara 26-year-old openly shared her love of the underbelly of society. Marilyn Manson, the TV serial killer show Dexter. As a so-called sugar baby, police say she picked up older men on the website SeekingArrangement.com and that she was a Silicon Valley prostitute with 200 clients. One of them was Google exec Forrest Hayes. At that point, she showed no concern for the condition of the victim in this case. Police say surveillance video shows Tickleman giving heroin to the married father of five as Hayes overdosed. She cleaned up the drugs. She uh, walked around with her glass of wine in her hand um, as she stepped over the body a number of times. You know, what's particularly shocking in this case, though, is just the glacial callousness and coldness that she showed towards the condition of the victim. I've certainly reviewed the video. I don't think there's been the most accurate representation in the media. Tickleman's public defenders say the scandalous image doesn't match the facts. Tickleman is a heroin addict, they say. She was Hayes' prostitute. But that, they say, was it. This case is about two adults who are engaged in mutual consensual drug usage. In the context of a sexual encounter initiated and encouraged by Mr. Hayes, there was no intent to harm or injure, much less kill Mr. Hayes. The attorneys say Tickleman was also present when a previous boyfriend in Georgia overdosed on heroin and died just a few months ago. But that, they say, is an unfortunate coincidence in the life of a heroin addict. Birds of a feather fly together. And that's been my experience in this business. And I'm sure that they were both engaged in some unhealthy, high-risk choices and lifestyle back there.